Hey guys, uh, just wanted to do a quick video. Uh, as you can tell from the title, I actually use this stuff, not brand name Windex slash Windolene. But it's got ammonia in it. And I had uh, part of a model, a trailer, that uh, had uh, far too much of an enamel wash put on it. There's still a few bits left. Well, that's not the point as to the efficiency of the Windex slash Windolene, uh, which is really good. It just scrubbed everything off, or peeled everything off. And a quick go with the toothbrush, old toothbrush, took a lot more off. But it's down to where I can redo it again. This is actually gray plastic underneath here. Uh, the color probably doesn't register, but it's actually this stuff, the Steinol Res Primer. Uh, I just wanted to do a video and let you guys know this stuff is tough. That's Windex poured onto it or sprayed onto it for a good five minutes and then soaked in a tub with more of it for five more minutes. Uh, and that was last night. It's been left to dry after being rinsed. Now there is a slight color change. I don't know if you guys can pick it up. Uh, the half track, this is untouched. This is a little bit paler, a little bit flatter after going through the Windex. Uh, so for better or worse, the Steinol Res really holds on to stuff. Uh, so if you have made a terrible mistake with it, you're in trouble. And if your trouble is with anything that's on top of it, it's still going to be there. Uh, I think for most of us that will be a good thing. But I'm walking away from this even more impressed with the Steinol Res stuff. I just thought I'd uh, let you guys know what I found last night. And uh, you can use the information as you need to. Anyway. Take care.